Health Professions Council Registrar Cornelius Weyulu says the laws of the country requires that the council test the competency of every graduate wishing to be registered as a health professional in Namibia. Four years ago or three years ago already, we started sensing that so many people are going outside and we're not sure where they are and all that and all that. And we engaged the Student Financial Assistance Fund, the Minister of Education, the Minister of Health, to say, look, um, the selection process, whoever is going to be funded with taxpayers' money, we need to make sure that those people are at a credible institutions outside. And they are following uh, programs that will enable them to be registered in Namibia when they are back. NBC News asked Weyulu what universities students should avoid. We deliberately decided to not to prescribe specific universities in specific countries. If you select specific countries or specific universities, you run a risk of excluding some countries that you do not know and universities that you do not know. And you will face a problem when you have Namibians who qualified from those countries coming back home. Weyulu warns against wasting of public resources and time and thus appeals to the Namibian Student Assistant Fund and others to avoid funding studies at irrelevant institutions that do not meet Namibia's requirements of accreditation. The Namibian standards and requirements for medical and dentistry registrations are available on HPCNA's website. Daniel Nadunya, NBC News, Venduk.